so big until at the end I watch. Oh, jeez. Oh, Hey Joe, that's not cool. I'm gonna hold my breath as we drive by. Fossil fuels, they're heating up and destroying the planet and sooner or later they're gonna run dry. Seven months ago, Cuba decided to solar power their schools and now in seven months, they've already got a thousand schools solar powered, 100% photovoltaic. That's really what we're all about. We're about shifting to something that's sustainable. Yeah! Yeah! We are a demonstration center for people to learn all about sustainable living. The idea is bring in people here that know nothing about renewable energy who are skeptical and think that it's still an environmentalist pipe dream that doesn't really work bring them into the center, show them that they can still have their cold beer and their cold ice cream while they're pro producing sustainably harvested energy. All these panels handle all of our utility needs here. They are totally silent, non-polluting, powering this entire site for 150,000 people a year. The only blackouts we see are intelligence blackouts on the part of the politicians. If the governor bought four compact fluorescent lights for every household in California, one water-saving showerhead, we would be able to shut down a hundred of the 1,000 power plants in California right now. So conservation, renewable energy, it's all a very simple solution. Instead, you know, here we're going off, calling it an energy crisis, 200 bills in Congress, drilling the Alaska National Wildlife Refuge, um, more oil, more gas. You know, the administration has run amok here when the solution is the simplest thing in the world. The solution's right here, all around us.